Hey. Totally okay drinking toilet water. Okay. Everybody thinks this about the poor toilet. Everybody thinks this about the poor toilet. The, the toilet is fine. The toilet water is fine. And I will show you. I will go over and show you what I mean. First, let me get warm. Let me get warm first. Because you need... Honestly, you need to know how a toilet works. You really do. <laughs> I take it you're Canadian, Waldo. I feel like we've discussed this before, but I can't remember. So you'll have to forgive me. <sighs> Unless you're like Saint Lucian or something. We're gonna go look at a toilet. Yeah, the bathroom in the Quonset hut should not be. Um, used. Bidet equals drinking fountain. You know, I when I was living in France, the people there were telling me that a bidet is not actually used for like cleaning your butt. It's used for cleaning your feet. Which I thought was interesting because there was a there was a bidet and a sink in a a bedroom from a very old house that I of a friend of mine's. And I was like, well, that's weird. And my friend was like, well, it's used for, it's actually used for um, cleaning your feet. So like you, before you go to bed, you'd clean your feet and your sheets would stay all nice and neat and clean, all that stuff. I know. They probably were. I'm okay with that. But eh, they're just ashamed. <laughs> But still, I mean, it kind of, it, it really did explain why there was a bidet in the, in the, re um, not the restroom, the, um, the bedroom where I was staying. really did. Yeah, the top of the toilet water is okay. I'm I'm getting there. I'm getting there, Jonah. I really want to I want I really want to teach people about this. Really? There we go. Huh. What's up with toilets today? Also, Sparky Pants, how in the world can you get arrested from using a toilet? I question your story. Yeah, it's the dome. We call that a bowl. Jonah, where are you from? Are you from the United States? From Canada? Funny Man Matt, hello and welcome! You asked the cops that? <laughs> was way better than the meal. New York? Okay. Gotcha. Oh, that's a bear. I don't want to go that direction. You got- what? Sparky pants. I call shenanigans. I call shenanigans. Yeah, you just- that's fair. Okay. Lima Zulu Tango! Hey! 
<laughs> chess pieces. <laughs> Welcome. How are you, LZT? Oh, I know, Eddie. That's fine. But here's the thing. Some people don't know. Some people don't understand. And they're like, why can we drink out of toilets and it's not going to kill me? And I'm going to I'm going to teach them why. I'm going to teach them why it's okay. And it'll be all right. <laughs> Covering your ass in case someone's lurking. <laughs> oh man. I know. Carva. Carva. Yeah, it is tap water. Do I have a lantern, gun, hatchet, crowbar, or flares? I do. I have all the things. Though I don't have a crowbar on me. Mostly because I don't currently need one. Teach them all the way. I think. Okay, from comics or the TV show or the game. Because I'm not caught up on the TV show. I don't read the comics, and I'm not caught up on the game. You're terrible. Oh no. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, LZT. All right, guys. Pull out your TILs, because you're going to learn something today. So this is a toilet, right? It's a basic toilet. I'm going to... We're going to learn things today. Where? There it is. Sorry, book series. We're we're looking at other things. Okay, I'm gonna draw a toilet a side view. Maybe it's like this. I think it's like this. Okay. Oops. Okay, we're drawing toilets. Will this be on the test? If you, if at some point I come back and I'm like, hey guys, does anybody remember how a toilet works? And you can describe to me in detail exactly how a toilet works. I might maybe just give you a game. Maybe. Um, we are not going to represent anything other than the water. Okay. Okay. And we're going to go full screen for this. We're going to go full screen for this. So we're going to keep that right there. Somebody yell at me if all of a sudden all my things go in the red. Actually, no. You won't be able to know that, will you? Ah! Ah! Oh, thank goodness. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Red. <laughs> okay. So that's kind of what a toilet looks like, right? It's kind of what a to toilet looks like. 
Now it's a side view and it's like dissected, right? So here is your portable potable water source. This comes from the wall. You can drink out of this wall water right here. So the water goes in that direction, right? So it goes into the toilet. Or the the so that's right there, right? And you've got like a little bit of like water that kind of fills the tank up here when you flush, right? That's fine. Well whatever. So when then you've got the hole down at the bottom. Toilet time with book, yes. We're learning how a toilet works. Fun stuff. So what happens when you flush is some there's a mechanism in here. The let's see here. We'll do this in green. So front view of the toilet. There's a thing in here that lifts up. There's a little hole down here for the water for the water to go out. And then your little lever. So this little lever right here, when you flush that, that lifts this thing up, which opens the the hole for all of this water to escape through this pipe. Okay? So all of this water in here, you can drink that. You can drink that. I wouldn't recommend it, especially if it looks a little bit dirty in there, but you can drink that. So that goes down through here, which is which this water also go touches, right? So that goes down through here, and right down here is where everything kind of stopped. So there's a little air pocket in here, and that's what stops sewer gases from coming up through the toilet. That's why the toilet is so genius, is because it has a little built-in trap for air to stop everything from coming in. So you've got this water, when you lift the lever, all of this water goes down this thing goes up and that opens the hole and so that all that water can go out this this pipe here okay and that's this pipe right here so that forces all of this water because it's got all this pressure up here to go down so now you've got this stuff it's like hey oh my gosh we're going down we're going down it's enough pressure to get above this little hump right here and then go down again. Okay. So then that sucks all of this water down along with it. So that's how it drains. Okay. So that's how it drains. So then you've got another mechanism in here. Like I don't know how specifically this works, but on this this end something else comes in through here and starts refilling the bowl. It doesn't refill it a lot, but just enough for you to have a nice little puddle to pee in. And then that's all stopped. This is all, this all fills up again. This stops. That fills up again because the 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 thing has now set filled up. There's like a little thing up here, a float, like a little ball of air that they have that once it hits a certain point, the tank is full and it doesn't need to fill up anymore. Okay? So all of this water is potable. You can drink that. You can drink that. Oh my goodness.
what are you all saying? Red, okay. Everything's in red. Red, the toilet. Right, the toilet, right? Okay, I jinxed it, of course. I know, you're missing the campfire. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ungoliant. Ungoliant, you just learned how a toilet works. That's that's what you just walked into. Everyone's staring at Cat. You guys. I don't know how to explain that. I, I really don't. All that I can think of is that it was not, it was, the toilet itself is potable each and every time. I don't know. <laughs> Instructions unclear? Flooded. <laughs> Bathroom flooded. Oh dear.